Okay, today, in this lesson, we are doing the right hand discipline. That's the exercise. Uh, I have a message that we uh, should go on the right hand. Let me see if I can find the person. Okay, let me, later I will mention the name of the person. Let's go straight to the lesson. Uh, you see, I was using the whole five fingers here. Sometimes three, sometimes four, some, sometimes two. It depends on what you want to play or what you wish to use, the fingers you wish to use. So, but to get full control of the right hand fingers from the thumb to the last finger, you have to discipline yourself. If I say discipline, what does it mean? Rehearsal, that's constant rehearsal. So let's go to the guitar board and do that rehearsal. You are using F for this. You see, we have F here. This is the C shape of playing the F. So we start from Mi, Fa, so, La, Ti, Do. You will see I'm using the thumb. So you have to divide the whole fingers here for the strings. So first string for this finger, that's the fourth finger or the last finger. Second string for third finger. Third string for second finger. Fourth string for the first finger. You see, so play it free, open. So you see, it's left with the two. So let the thumb control the two. You see, that is the basic discipline one must have. It's not easy to do it at a time or at a go, but you have to do constant rehearsal. So let the thumb play the fifth string. Let it play the sixth string. So you see, divide the fingers. Don't let be let the, the, the fingers be in line like this. If it be in one line like this, they will not have any place because sometimes the fingers are thick, so they will take more space. So let it balance this way. Don't let it be this. If they all form one line, you see, you see, it means it has position up to the fifth. There will be no place for the thumb to play. So let it be sliding mode. I mean the sliding mode like this. You see, slide the fingers so that they can form a particular pattern on the strings. So here, you see, let it form the, so that this one will have the access. So let the whole fingers be like this. So let's go as we have, we know how we are starting the right hand. That's the basic beginning. So let's go either this. So we are playing the surface in the C. Mi, Fa, So. So if you take a look, Mi, Fa, So, all from the thumb. La, Ti, Do, the same thumb. So, with the thumb. So we are continuing from the fourth string. So you see, this one is on it. The first finger is there already, was there already. So you don't have to bring the thumb down for this exercise. So for the whole fourth string, anything that comes on the fourth string, the first finger. Then when we move to the next string, that is the third. You see this one, the index finger is there, the middle finger is there. It plays so la, then ti do re from the. So let me play it this way. Then when we go to the down string. That is mi fa so fa mi so mi mi fa so fa mi. We are going to the re do ti la so fa mi re do ti la so fa mi. You see, let's take it slow.
So that's how you should rest more every day continuously. So practice slowly. Finish. So, then we play the chord. Fa. So we can play the fa this way. Or we can eliminate the first finger and bring, because if you have the last chord. Or. So let's do this simple exercise. So that is do we play the full chord. You see, do me, do me, so do me. When we move to far like this, you don't have to play it this way. You can play it that way, but so because so we have the six strength, so let me go. just an introduction or uh, the beginning so we will continue the same lesson with all the things we use to play with the plectrum or two fingers so that you get much control on the right hand fingers as well because there are some things if you do not use the six or five strings uh, you will not get the sound clear so Sometimes, because of the speed, we normally use two or three fingers for solo. But the basic thing is to rehearse what, as I've said. Certain chord chain of it's chord chain playing. You see, I'm using the finger because of the nature of the chord, you cannot just turn the chord. So sometimes you have to employ the fingers, at least four or three will be normal. So at the beginning, you can choose to play with the only two. Very easy. 
this is uh, the first step i've done a lesson on this before but it was uh, some year maybe a year ago so we have to revive what we did previously so today this is the first part in this year for uh, finger picking techniques this is strictly finger picking we'll go straight to the plectrum session very soon so this is finger picking so all of you you are all welcome right answer right i miss our uh, my father sambani augustus you are all welcome why oji samojanfi you are all welcome oliver from you are all top followers uh, if i don't know mention your name it doesn't mean i don't know you i know everybody but sometimes you know we are more than two thousand getting to three thousand people here so it's not easy to mention everybody's name. My friend Kim in Nigeria, uh, clever, clever Kim. Uh, Emmanuel Otu, Otu, Emmanuel Otu Evans, uh, Fidel is born here. Uh, okay, let me end this here. I will take time to write the names so that I can mention and give everybody a shout out as desired. So we are going straight to the next lesson. This is uh, finger picking. So let me add the platform picking rehearsal today too so that uh, we are speeding up what we were or uh, what we did in the previous lessons so we are continuing so we have to refresh the memory thank you for joining me we shall meet very soon